race one, the Hollywood Bets Durbanville welcomes you. Maiden Juvenile Plate jumped uh, over the 1,000 metres. And the winner, number two, Blue Holly. Well done uh, to Mengapi Dadamasi from, uh, well, he's the groom that looks after Blue Holly. So he receives 1,000 rand. Uh, so thank you very much to Hollywood Bets and Cape Racing. The condition, oh, Ashton's back. We'll start off with him. I was going to say we're going to start with Glenn. But Ashton, uh, you, you look like a man who jumped determined out the pens. You know, my instructions was to go to the front today. Um, obviously, with the experience, we thought it would be hard to beat from the front. She just reproduces the second run and she won a good race. Is she the type of filly that uh, clearly li she likes the 1,000? Do you think that she'll get a, a stretch further? You know, I think today, I think she's still over the 1,000. She's the best. I think 12 went a little bit too far for her. But she won a good race. It's a big thing to Mr. Cotson and well to the owners. And it's a good start for you. Well done. Thank you. Yeah, that's Ashton Aries. Next up, we've got uh, Glenn Cotson, the conditioner. And uh, Glenn, well done. Yeah, thank you. Um, we we're we're uh, very positive that she'll run a great race. Um, you know, we it's, when you they put up these juvenile bonuses, you, you really want to go go and get them. So we, we ran in the 400, 500,000 rand uh, over 1,200 with a touch sharp for her. I thought, well, maybe she will have one more crack at the 700,000 rand race. And she didn't run a bad race. I mean, she only ran five lengths of them, but she stopped that last little bit. And the jock said, bring her back to five. She can't miss. Find Dermal and see if you can crack a draw. Well, when we nominated for Dermal, we got draw two. I said to the ladies, am I right? I said, come on, guys, you got to, this is it, we're going to win it today. So, so excited for them because geez, they are long suffering. They breed their own, their own horses and they're very, very patient with them. And uh, I managed to uh, convince them to buy this little filly. I thought she'd just be grease lightning and I wanted to give them a, a, an early two year old uh, winner. So, yeah, just fabulous. So, well done to Applewood Stud. And uh, obviously, the 100,000 rand bonus to uh, BSA, thank you very much. We really appreciate it. Well done, Glenn. Thank you. Next up, as Glenn said, long suffering, but uh, look, oh how sweet is the win? I would have loved to have bred her, but well, you know, we, yeah, we are long suffering, but we, we, we st we're still in the game to stay. So um, thanks to Hollywood Bets for it's going to be a fabulous day. And um, thanks, Glenn. And Aries rode a perfect race. Was it pretty exciting? Did you, were you a little bit under pressure at end stage? Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> well, let, I'll ask you, were you by any chance under pressure? No, I wasn't under pressure, but it was the most exciting <laughs> race. Yes, thank you. No, and well done for the win. Yes, thank you very much, and thank you to Hollywood Bets. <laughs> there you go, Bloodstock, check of 100,000 Rand. Yeah, there you go. Don't forget to thank BSA. Huh? <laughs> there you go. Thank you to Bloodstock South Africa. You can come across, and uh, if you could all also smile for a photo, there's okay. Chase. So you can smile for a photo, and I'll just mention number two, Blue Holly, the daughter of Give Me the Green Light, uh, Applewood Trading trading as Nodora Stud. Uh, the breeders, well done to Lennon Ross for the win, Glenn Cotson the condition, and Ashton Aries for the ride. Number two, Blue Holly wins the first.